stop getting my hair done just to come up here with y'all. So y'all better be, y'all better be like, look free, uh-uh. But I had to come up here and tell y'all this fantastic fucking story. I'm like, I'm this myself. I'm like, let me tell, let me tell Twitch what just happened. Remember I told y'all I got, I got, I hate when that music play. Hell yeah. I'm going to watch the baddies wilding out and all that shit. You don't got to worry. Is it about Coney Island? Yes. I'm like, what the fuck? Listen, y'all have to stop catfishing me. Because I'm Jamaican. I'm going to fall for it every time. Every time. Like, no funny shit. Like, I'm going to fall for it every time. In my world, pussy run it. So, like, if you want to, you know, do all that, I'm with it. Look at that. Somebody all up in my comments. Oh, like, come on. I'm serious. I'm, that's me. If you want, if you text me, I'm, I, I swear to God, you can line me. Easy. If you text me, yo, pre, I feel like giving the pussy up. You know, I got my pussy on me tonight. I'm shot in there. Zoom. Coming. Coming. I got Chipotle for dinner. The toilet gonna be your friend. Like, I'm coming. Don't ever say, you know, pre, we need some photos. Photos. What kind of photos you talking about? You gotta talk correct. Because you know, I be on Twitter. Anyway, let me tell you about this story and then we're gonna get to the Twitch. This girl wrote me. Her name was Jasmine. She's like, she been texting me for like a month. Like, I'm like, all right, I'm going to give this girl a month. Because y'all know that man. Y'all know the man catfished me. That man really, really catfished me. Literally. Like, I got catfished by a dude before. So, I gave this girl. I'm like, I'm going to give this girl, or whatever the fuck she is, a month. A month we're talking, we chatting on the phone, everything. She don't look no way over the phone. Over the phone, she look good. You know, body nice, all that, Coca-Cola, baka. You understand? Like, she look good over the phone. I'm like, all right. So, one day, we like, we finally gonna meet. She like, yeah, come to Coney Island. First of all, I put that shit in my map. It was three hours and 45 minutes. Just to let you know. Three hours and 45 minutes. I'm like, whoa. This is peculiar, but I'm going to go. Boom. I put gas in my car. I had to get I, I had to get gas. Not once, but five fucking times on the way there. Like, five fucking times. Mind you, I don't know nobody. You know, I, I'm from... I'm from upstate, so I don't know nobody. Mind you, I just moved to Connecticut, guys. So I don't know nobody. At the time when I was going to go meet Jasmine, I was at my old crib. And I was like, I was just moving the rest of my shit out. Boom, so I said, as I'm doing that, I'm just going to go see her. Took the three-hour drive. I got down there. It was like nighttime. Nah, it was like fucking 5 o'clock. Mind you, I left at 11 you know, I left at 11. As I got down there, now I'm like, yo, where you at? I'm at, I'm like, at the Addy that you sent me. She sent me to some 45 West Street. Still remember it like it was just a couple of days ago. Because it was a couple of days ago. 45 West Street, bro. So, I'm in front of a fucking Burger King, a T-Mobile, a Taco Bell, and a Planet Parenthood. I'm like, first of all, how the fuck is all these businesses right here? So you can kill a baby, go get some eats, and go in and shop for your crib? Like, I was like, what the fuck? Like, I, like they have a Taco Bell and a Burger King next to a Planet Parenthood. So you can just kill your baby and just go get something to eat. Like, how do y'all feel about that? After that, the girl like, I'm coming. 
she get she lit guys she literally no fucking lie she literally walks out the planet parenthood please so i'm sitting down i'm like this cannot be the bitch so you cleanly freshly came off of a kill and you're fucking trying to get in my v so you're about to sit your baby you're about to sit, sit your abortion butt on my motherfucking car seat so i'm like all right She's like, what color car are you in? I'm like, I'm in the black whip. Pop out. Boom. She got in my car. She's like, oh. she's. Firstly, any bitch that get in your car and say the name of your car that you got and be like, ooh, this is nice. Boom. So mind you, she's walking out the Planet, Fit, Planet Partner. Planet Parenthood. I can never say that name. You know Planet Fitness and Parenthood? Planet Fitness and Parenthood. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Those two tongue twisters. Oh my God. They get me. I hate being Jamaican. They get me. So anyway. She walking out the Parenthood. After killing the baby. She has on like this crop top shirt. With like a jacket. But it's dingy. Like it's dingy. Like you can tell. Like she's dingy. Like I don't know if it was her skin that was turning me up. I don't know what the fuck it was, but something on her was not like. It's like I didn't smell her, but I'm saying if I open this wrapper, you know, like if you see a candy, and you'd be like, yes, this is stale. So I'm I like seeing her, and I'm like, I don't smell you, but I know if I definitely fuck you, there's gonna be a scent. Like you know what I'm saying? Boom. She get in the car, she yelled, she said, oh, you got a BMW. I'm like, mm-hmm. So we start driving. I'm like, what you want to get? Like, what you want to get into? You know, like, I'm just, she's already dirty. I know she's filthy. Like, I'm just looking at her. I'm like, ugh. So I just light my spleen. Now we just smoking. I don't smoke with people. I knew she was like, I knew she was a bum. And she, like, was a fiend. I already knew where this party was going to go once she said, you don't pass the spleas? Oh, you didn't bring your own weed? I'm confused. You know, you just came off of killing your baby. I thought you had a celebration package. You know what I'm saying? So I passed the L to her. I'm like, you can keep it. Boom. After that, she like, oh, why are you acting like that? I'm like, I'm not acting no way. I just don't, you know, smoke with people. I don't smoke with people. I'm Jamaican, you know. That's what I don't. After that, we all just, I'm me and her just chilling. I'm like, I'm about to go get something to eat. I'm like, what you want? This bitch gonna look at me like, five guys is back there. What? I'm thinking she want to train. Because ain't no fucking way you telling me that you want a five guys burger. She like, I'm like, okay. Like, what the fuck? I'm like, all right. Ain't no way you telling me. You want anything at five guys. What? Nah. I said, boo. Okay. Went right into McDonald's. Boom. After I went into McDonald's now, now we just all chilling. Right? She like, oh. Should we go to McDonald's? She like, oh, I want a Big Mac. I said, um, what's your, I said, do you have a, I said, you like McChickens? She said, yeah. I said, give her a $3 bundle, the McChicken one. I don't know what be wrong with these bitches, but girl, when you get in my passenger seat, if you ain't a 10, don't try to go in. If you're not a 10, don't try to go in. If you a smooth five, be that girl. Be that girl. Just get in my seat. Like, I swear to God, if you know you're ugly, and even if you don't think you're ugly, but if multiple people have told you that you're ugly, just believe that you're a little bit ugly. Like, you know what I'm saying? Multiple people. Some people told me I'm cute. Multiple people have told me I'm ugly. I'm like a turtle ugly. You know, people still fuck with me. But if multiple people and nobody, if no purr boys, if no purr boys ever told you that you're cute, nine times out of ten, you're ugly. You know what I'm saying? Nine times out of ten, you're not, you're not that girl. Just always think about that. Think, sit back and be like, hmm, has a gay boy ever told me I look good? You know what I'm saying? Never. So you shouldn't think like that. If you're not told, if you're not a ten or a fucking eater, you're not getting anything. I, oh my God, chat, do y'all love to eat? I love, oh my 
I love me an eater. You understand? If you are an eater, let me tell you something. If you're an eater, I, I volunteer as tribute if you're an eater. If you do anything like that, girl, you can get a Big Mac, a quarter pounder, a fish fillet meal, and you can get a Happy Meal. Anything you want, you can get. You know what I'm saying? You understand? I love y'all too. I love, I love it. But if you're not that and you know what I'm saying, like don't get in my seat and do anything. Boom. She's eating the McChicken now. She's eating. We cool. Yeah. Uh, eaters can get what they want. I'm gonna hold you. I was not having fun. Like, and I told her, like we in the car, she's smoking. Like I'm a fun type of person, but when she started beatboxing, I'm like, you're dirty. So, like, I don't beatbox with dirty bitches. Like, are you going to suck dick or are you just going to beatbox right now? Like, I don't want, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not about to play around. Like, what are you going to do? So, I wasn't having fun. Like, I turned around and I looked at her and I said, I'm not having fun. Like, this is not fun for me. She said, so what do you want to do? I said, like, I leaned back. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you're in a car with somebody, if you're in a car, let me tell you, if you're in a car with somebody and you put your hands like this, oh, brother, she's going to get the picture. You know? That's what I'm saying. Like, you just put your hand like, oh, brother. And I kept, you know, I'm a complaining ass nigga. Like, I kept saying, I just bought you food and you're rapping. Like, I just bought you food. Why are you rapping? You should be unwrapping me. I should be getting unwrapped. Why are you rapping? Why are you rapping? Like, what are you talking about? If you was just going to take the food, why didn't you jump out my car while I was driving on the highway? Mid-drive. Don't start rapping, boo. I'm like, why are you rapping? She said, oh, I thought that's what you like to do because I know you got a song on YouTube. Girl, this is not, I'm not Diddy in the studio. I'm Diddy ready to fuck. Get to it. Like, for real. Like, I'm like, girl, you're being delusional. After that, you know what I'm saying? She said, what do you want to do? I said, brother, this guy stinks. She was like, what? So I leaned back. She's like, how did you put that on that quick? I said, Matrix. Girl, I've been ready since I picked you up. Like, come on. She trying to pull that, oh, you know I'm sick. You know I just got out this name. What's up, bro? She's like, oh, you know I'm sick. You know I just got out the hospital. I said, this is going to get... I had to look at her real, 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 real good. I said, I don't want this to get violent, so... You're going to make this the hard way. You're going to make this the easy way. That's all I'm saying. Because if you leave out of this car without giving me no play, I'm going on Instagram and you're going to be a bum bitch. So it's either it's your life or it's your coochie. You pick. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit not sick. You trying to take it home to that nigga. I'm not playing. I'm like, you trying to take it home to that man. I'm like, after that, she got asked, like, why did you even have it on anyway? Girl, I be walking around with it. You understand? I'm sick. I told y'all that. I'm delusional. Like, I said that to y'all. When I be acting, I be doing mad sick shit. Like, have, how much sick shit do y'all think I be doing? Like, if I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here moaning while you sucking plastic, I'm not sick? <laughs> like, I'm not sick? I feel like, I feel like I keep telling y'all, live in y'all delusion. Like, if y'all live in y'all delusion, life would be so much more better. Life would be so much more better. Live in your delusion. I live in mine. Like, literally. Like, we in the car, right? Now, I told y'all, she gave it up. She gave the coochie up. You know, she gave it up. She stepped over the seat. And then a little bit of breeze passed my nose. But we was already there. You know, like, when pussy's thinking you're already there, guys... Just give it up. Just like, you know what I'm saying? If the pussy stinker, you're already in the situation. You didn't know before you got there. So you can't just stop 
You know what I'm saying? Like, listen, listen, if you just stop, like, you're already fucking. So if you just stop fucking it, wow. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, she just killed the baby, so I already knew she killed the baby. Like, I seen her coming out, and I still wanted it. Obviously, I'm half dog. <laughs> I'm half dog, obviously, because dead meat don't, don't disattract me. So, I'm still killing it. I'm like, fuck it, we in the V anyway, it's hot in the V. So when hotness and coochie mix, you know, a little, it's going to create something. Like, it's going to, it's either going to create a BV smell, you know, that's all I'm going to do. So I had to wrap it up. Like, the scent was killing me, so I just had to wrap it up. I had to wrap it up. You know, when I, you know, I fake Lena, uh, <sighs> boom, bang, there goes the weasel. That's, yo, you can tell that I'm. Like, I don't even know why girls even think this is real legit. Because let me tell you something. Just like I say, I, I, like, I moan when I, when y'all suck the strap. Literally. When y'all nut, like, when I nut, I be like, ah, boom, bang, there goes the weasel. <laughs> no. All right, back to the story, because y'all keep throwing me off. I'm not playing. All right? That, if you do that, let me tell you, if you do that to the girl, Ah, boom, bang, there goes the weasel. She's going to be like, damn. I never heard that before. Listen. Take advice from me. This is what I'm telling you. I'm telling y'all this because I'm. this is what happens really in my life. Like, if I tell y'all something, I want y'all to hear me out. This is what legitly happened. Like, legit happened. After me and her did anything... I didn't believe her when she said, like, after we do anything, I'm going to come to you. I'm like, what do that mean, come to me? Like, I'm like, what? That makes no sense. You know, are you? I'm like, are you fucking nuts? How are you going to come to me? I did not know she meant she was going to come home with me. <laughs> I'm like, what? Why the fuck would you come home to me if I had my girlfriend at home? She gonna look at me in my face, you my nigga now. You just catfished me, boo. You just killed the baby. You just catfished me. Boo, you just catfished me. Like, why would you, you just catfished me. I'm letting her know, like, listen, I just got out of jail. I'm like, I just got out of jail. I don't have, I said, girl. I just got out of jail. I don't need to go back. I said, I don't need to go back. So please, just get out the car. Like, I did. I said, please just get out the car. That's all I want. Thank you for the sub. I'm like, I'm like, just get out the car. She gonna look at me like I don't I don't feel like it. You know, like let me tell you something, guys. I never swung so motherfucking fast a day in my life. When that bitch said she didn't feel like getting out the front seat of my car. Oh she I'm like, you you bet the I'm she said I didn't feel like I'm like, what? I said, girl. I reached over and grabbed her whole entire face like this. And never, I punched her, I punched her up so motherfucking bad. Literally. So, remember, remember what part of the story that I'm on. Alright guys? Remember what part of the story that I'm on. Because somebody keeps, that. every time when I tell y'all to remember what part of the story I'm on, it means I'm about to eat somebody up. So I want y'all to know that. This, um, really, really, um, that's your name, R-I-L-E-Y-N-A-A-M, you got my attention. Listen, a blessing as big as your back is not gonna come to you if you be on my dick through these whole comments. Why do you keep repeating, LaPree been to jail? LaPree was in jail. Do you want me to go to jail for beating your ass? Do you want me to fuck you up? You want me to beat your ass and go to jail? Like, you're so annoying. All my comments is like, they're ignoring you. They don't give a fuck. You want me to beat your ass? Do you literally want me to unscrew your fucking head like a bottle top? Do you want me to do that? You want me to go to jail for killing a fucking Twitch fan? Huh? 
every fucking second, every time. Lapree went to jail, y'all. Lapree went to jail, y'all. You don't think they the first person to know? It's not funny. Broke ass bitch, you all up. Bro, she's a broke ass bitch. How the fuck? You're not even a subscriber. So that means you take three minutes to watch the fucking ads to say that? Like, why are you taking three minutes out of your day to watch the ads just to say, Yah, LaPree went to jail? Did you tell on me? No, for real. Did you fucking tell on me, bitch? Like, what the fuck? I'm so, I'm, I'm pretty sure they're so, lie, y'all not tired of hearing about me going to jail? Like, every time, they, every, I swear to God, every time when I say to go to jail, they be like, what you do now, bitch? They be like, what you do now, bitch? She all up in my motherfucking comments, pre went to jail, pre went to jail, pre went to jail, bitch, you want me to go to jail for killing you and your family? Bitch, I'll burn your house. Literally. I will come through your fucking window like the Tooth Fairy, bitch, and leave a grenade underneath your pillow. No money. Don't fuck around. What? Where was I at? Bitch, you lucky I'm on it. It's a new year. And I said I wasn't bending none of y'all big bad bitches. Gonna be in my comments. Everybody's annoyed. I never see my motherfucking comments be so annoyed. Like, I never see my comments be annoyed. My mom. Fuck y'all fuck is up with this bitch? All up in my motherfucking comments, just talking, bitch, just yapping. Yapping ass bitches. Fuck. Back to what the fuck I was saying. Like I was saying, no, fuck you, bitch, go love yourself. Obviously, because you wouldn't be in my comments if you loved yourself. Back to what the fuck I was saying. All right, what was I saying again? I'm so sorry I had to pause and do that. Like I was saying, that bitch was in the front of my car talking about some she wasn't leaving. After I turned around and zailed her a, brrr, a million times, now me and her is fighting. We fighting. We fighting. I never, ever, ever, ever had nobody fight to be in my car. I'm like, why are you in my... I'm like, what the fuck? Why are you fighting to give me... Like, you're fighting to be in my car. The fuck out my car. You fighting to be in my car, in my fucking car, trying to be in my car. Like, every time I'm like, I don't even, I don't even want to talk about it. Every time I talk about it, I get so mad. This girl fighting to be in my car. Bitch, what the fuck? You can't sleep in here? Like, everybody's homeless? Nobody got a home? You beating me up to be in my car, ripping my shirt? Sure, rip my shirt, rip my bra, my titties is all out. I'm like, I just ripped my bum off, Clyde Court. Girl, you just ripped up my coat. To be in my car. I'm like, oh no. You just got a free meal. You got dick. You got smoked up. Now you need a place to sleep. You thought this was the shelter. Get out. Got out my car. So I took the keys out the engine, right? Got out my car. This bitch gonna lock the door from the inside. So now we playing locky locky. You know, she locking the door. I'm locking. I open the door. She locking the door. I'm opening the door. She locking the door. I'm opening the door. I said, bitch. I swear to my mother, when I get, oh my God, when I get time to get in this car, I'm not going to play with you. I'm really not going to play with you. I said, I'm not playing with you when I get in that car. Yo, finally. So now, you know, like I tricked her. I opened the car and then I act like I was locking it, but I opened it and grabbed her out. Now I'm grabbing out. This bitch held out. You know the little screwy thing right there at the top that you can hold on to? She put her jacket in there, her jacket hand, so she can, even if I pull her out, she's still in there. Guys, I had no other choice. I just held my hand over her mouth. I held my hand over her mouth. I was like, bitch, I don't give a fuck. You're dying. Like, this is it. You're dying. You're dying. She, I was like, you're dying. I was like, you're dying. I had, like, I'm like, what the fuck? I'm calling help. I think, like, in New York, when people see... Like, other couples fighting, they just think that's, like, a normal day for them. I'm like, I'm like, no, I really need help. I'm like, no, I need help. I'm like, I don't know this girl. I, I need help. I'm like, what the fuck? Don't help me. I don't know this girl. I'm like, no, I truly don't know her. What the fuck? Help me. What? Everybody's sitting there recording laughing. I'm like, no, I don't know her. Like, what the fuck? She picked her coat up and went back in the car. 
oh my god, guys. She went back in the car. I had no choice. I just got back in the car. I was done fighting. I was done fighting, guys. I went back in the car. I said, you can come with me. Fuck it. You can come with me. Guys, we drove around for an hour. An hour. <laughs> an hour before that bitch got tired and said she was going to go home. Talking about some, I just wanted to spend a day with you to see how you was. <laughs> you won. I drove all the way upstate. I drove all the way upstate. You understand? I drove all the way upstate because how you going to get home now? You all the way on my ends. Bitch, I can kill you right now and tie up your tie up every piece of your body and throw it somewhere. I could have planted that bitch. I could have cut her up and planted her. Literally put some soil in the bag and put her right underneath the ground and planted a tree. I swear to God, I could have planted that bitch. But I was just like, I'm going to take you up here. I'm going to take you up here. And you're going to be literally, you're going to be lost. I'm going to take you up here and you're going to be lost. You're not going to have no way to get home if I take you up here. You know what I'm saying? She was like, oh, no, 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 no. Stop, stop. She gave me some gas money. And was like, take me back home. Guys, that's why I did not go live the two days. Because I was literally tired. Like, I'm, I was literally tired. Like, I'm literally sitting here doing cause and effect with this girl getting her out my car. I'm, I'm, sitting, to my, I'm sitting to myself like, this is not player. This is not Batman like. This is not G. This is not what thugs do. Thugs don't come like thugs don't communicate and com communicate and compress with they hoes. I never seen no pimp do no negotiation with no whore. I'm like pimps don't negotiate with they bitches. Like I'm like what the fuck? This ain't no player like. This is not player like. I'm like this is not. I I went to the I took her gas money. I went to the nearest gas station. There was one in the Bronx. There was one in the Bronx, like two blocks away from the police station. So I went to the police. I went right to the gas station, and I told her, I said, "Girl, I'm a. I, I can walk you to the police station and get a ride. That's the. That's the furthest I can bring you. That's the furthest I can bring you. But this little rally, this little thing that we got going on." This is not going to happen. This is not going to happen no more. It's 11 o'clock at night. It's done. Like, it's literally done. All I just want to say is, she left. She ended up calling her friend. Her friend ended up coming. Her friend ended up coming. You know what I'm saying. Her friend wanted to take a picture with me and shit like that. Her friend was like, oh, I know you. Did it. I was like, come get this bitch. I don't give a fuck who you know. Come get this bitch. This bitch is annoying. It's done. It's over. It's done. The thing is, all I'm saying is, T.I., Staten Island is a no-go. Wait, where was I? I don't even know if I was on Coney or Staten Island. All I know is that shit was three miles, three hours away. That bitch was dirty and corny. And I've been seeing dead babies ever since I fucked her. Literally. I think I fucked her babies. Her dead babies. Oh, my. Coney, I'm telling you, I've been, it's like, I would never go to Coney Island ever again. That's like way out the way. That was like way out the way. Like way out the way. I would never do that again. And God, I promise you, I think that's why my blessings is being stopped. Because I fucked that girl's baby. I think my blessings is stopping. Because that, that was fucked up that I did. That girl was supposed to be a mom. I picked her up, fed her, smoked her up, gave her dick. That was bad of me to do. You know what I'm saying? I should have never did that. That was real. That was urban of me to do. You know, that was really what that was. That was hoggish. I don't like that I did that. You know what I'm saying? Like, this was really not good for me to do. But, me, I'm, for, I'm not going to do nothing crazy. That was it. 
That's the end of my, literally, that's the last crazy thing I'm doing for 2024. I'm not going to moan no more when y'all suck the strap. I'm not going to fake nut anymore. I'm not going to do none of that. I'm literally, I'm, guys, I'm so serious. That was it. I already did some crazy shit during 2024. 2025 is my year. That's my year. I swear. That's my year. Because I feel, me, I travel to go fuck dead baby coochie. Who does that? <laughs> like, come on. Who does that? Literally. Who the fuck travels to go fuck a girl that just is freshly off of abortion? Nobody but pre. <sighs> like, that, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy that y'all listen. Thank y'all guys for listening because I had to get that off my chest. Like, I felt like that. I would, I couldn't sleep. I'm all sleeping. All I hear is wah. I'm like, what the fuck is that? Wah. Like, what is that? Wah, wah, wah. I'm like, what is that? I called Murphy. Murphy said, I told Murphy the story. Murphy's like, La Princia. Ya demon. Come on from a phone. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? You know, I saged out my house. When that situation happened, I saged my house out. I passed the fuck out in here. I'm not going to hold y'all. Stay away from that. No, I'm not going to hold y'all. That sage, whew, I passed the fuck out in here. I almost died. I almost died, guys. I lit me some sage in here, went around the house, passed right the fuck out in the kitchen, woke up. Why? Somebody was like, you were supposed to open the windows. I never knew that. They said you were supposed to open the windows and the door to let them go out. Girl, why the fuck I closed myself in here with everything? That's why That's why I fucked the girl with the dead babies. Because when I saged out the house, they the, the ghosts had nowhere to go. So they all went in my mouth and went in my body. Duh. They went in my mouth and went in my body. And obviously, obviously something took me over to make me fuck that girl. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. That's why when I went home with my girlfriend that night, my girlfriend was like, you smell different. I'm like, what you mean I smell different? What are you, half how? She was like, no. She was like, no, you don't smell good. I'm like, what you mean? She's like, you don't smell like you. I'm like, what? I'm like, what? I don't smell good. She's like, you don't smell good. I'm like, for real? That's what I'm, she's like, yup, your straps stink. I'm like, what? Because it couldn't be my breath. Because we all know, that's what I'm saying. Like, this is why, this is what I, this is what I think that girl was waiting for. I think that girl was waiting for head. But I was looking at her, guys. I don't, I don't tell y'all. I don't, I don't eat. I'm going to tell y'all, I'm going to tell y'all a secret. Like, I don't eat pussy. Like, you know, like, I don't, I never, I never tried it. Like, am I a kid? I'm shy. I'm shy. Like, I'm shy. When somebody asks me, like, I'm just shy. I'd be like, what? That's why my last... That's the, the, Okay, guys, I'm going to be honest. That's why my last girlfriend left me. She was like, oh. Oh, that girl was really... She was not playing. She wanted that thing eight or left. Like, she wasn't playing. I was like... She was like, you don't eat it? I was like, no. She said, get over here and eat this puss. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. But I never did, guys. I never did. No. I never ate it. Y'all don't know that? Like, no, I feel like if you're really, if you're really a supporter, you would know that I don't eat it. Like, that's what I think that girl was waiting for. Cause she already done. You know me. I was fake. I was like. She was like, you feel that? I was like, yes. So. <sighs> she was like, it feels good. I was like, yes, sir. Uh, the fuck? I was like, oh my God. Uh, uh, uh. I hate bitches that be like, oh. I hate girls that be like, oh, you gotta, like, you know, you gotta eat it to make it wet. Girl, first of all, don't play around. So, like, I was like, oh. I was like, oh. Uh. 
You know, I was like, oh, like, like literally, like she at first she was like, I never did this before. So you telling me you never suck dick? She was like, no, I never. You know, I'm like, what? Like you never sucked the strap before? She was like, no. I'm like, oh, oh. So I think like that's what she was waiting for for me to do that, but that's not what was happening. I don't eat it. Like, I would never eat it, you know? Let me tell y'all why. I had a little last girl, you know? Like, I had a last girl, and I was fingering her. I did the finger test like this. I tasted it in my mouth. I never had pussy that strong. To ever hit me on the inside of my lungs, I said, what the fuck is this? Tear gas? <laughs> That's why I never, ever, 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 ever did it. I never did it. So when that girl was waiting, I think that's what that she was waiting for. I think she was waiting for that, and that's not what was happening. I dropped her right off at the gas station. Her friend came and got her, and that's what it was. You know what I'm saying? But I'm telling you, that girl that I fingered, she ruined it for every bitch in the world. Literally, that pussy was really in the sewer wall. <laughs> Like, literally, I'm like, bombo cloud, toxic, we as AC pussy. That's what this is. I'm like, this is really an AC pussy talking about some I drink tea. What kind of tea? What kind of tea? You got to be boiling the river water. Literally, I'm telling y'all girls, take care of y'all anus, y'all rainus, take care of it. Literally, I had a crazy week. I had a bad weekend. This that's this is what really happened to me on the 2024. This is what I'm coming out here. I just had to tell you, like I just had yeah a lot. Of, let me tell y'all. And another thing, when girls be like they be drinking tea and shit like that, it be twisted. <laughs> it be twisted. Literally, it be blueberry twisted tea. You know, it be shit like that. It be four locos. It be Budweisers. It be shit in cans. It don't be nothing. You know, like it don't be anything good. Like, you know what I'm saying? I love me a tea. Like, if you know me, you know I wake up and drink tea. I drink tea. You know, I, I let the farts out. You got to bubble, let the farts out your belly. You got to do all of that. You know what I'm saying? You got to let the fart out. Even if you were a man, let the fart out. Don't don't hold it in. No, well, no fart. Because when you hold in the fart, your body starts getting big up here and you start burping, burping. Burping, you know, you start getting heartburns and shit like that. Let go of the farts. See what I'm saying? Miss Netta is like that because Miss Netta don't fart. See what I'm saying? Miss Netta don't fart in front of Charles. That's why her butt is like that was sucked in and tucked in and shit like that. You got to let it out. I'm telling you. Y'all remember the story when I went to the doctor and I had to fart mad bad? And I didn't know the doctor was doing a belly scan on me. And he was like, I see the two little gas bubbles. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Remember, he was like, you said your body was in shape. I'm like, yeah. He was like, you got two gas bubbles in your belly right now as we speak. Y'all remember that? I'm telling y'all, y'all never know when a situation like that gonna happen. That really snuck up on me. Like, I changed my doctor after he told me that. I'm like, what? You really gonna x-ray my stomach? Like, I feel like that's personal use. You know? I feel like that's personal use. Shit like that. Like, you can't ask me stuff like that. That's personal use. Don't be scanning my belly. Like... Literally. Yeah, doctors don't be giving a fuck. <laughs> I'm telling... But nah, thank y'all for listening to that story. Because I really had to get that off my chest. I just holding me back. I'm like, nah. I'm like, nah, I gotta go tell them. If I don't go tell them, this is this is crazy. But thank y'all so much. Let's get to this um 21V with this midget. I'm scared of midgets. Like, that's another thing that I'm scared of. Listen, I'm scared of the dark, and I'm really, really scared of midgets. Like, they're, like why the fuck are you not big like everybody else? The Barunic TV, and I'm back with another banger! Like, banger! Y'all, like, I would have kicked him. Like, what the fuck? Know how we coming, man? Hey, this is the moment y'all been waiting for, bruh. Yes! We got 20 baddies on the way, bruh. Yes! We're talking about all... Like, look at him. Like, I would have kicked him in... Like, I don't give a fuck. Like, I don't like midgets. Like, that's how mad. I, that's ignorant. Like, I hate that, but he is so little. Like, midgets really scare me. Like, what the fuck? 
Pants. Yes. All sizes. Yes. All shapes. Yes. Like, no, can you roll a taco? Like, uh, no, can a midget make a taco? Like, are they hands big enough to make a taco? Like, can you, can they do that? Yes. All heights. Yes. Are you ready for this, bro? Yes. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I don't think you can handle what's coming, bro. Hey, I'm right. gonna do it all. I'm gonna... Uh, it's that uh, pressure, man. Yes. This ain't that juicy pressure. This that pressure pack. All right. I'm telling you, that water, you heard me? That water. That water, you go 